Right now at five, CCSU students allowed back in their dorms after a fire last night. It started on the first floor of the James Residence Hall Monday evening. And students were bused to a hotel last night as fire officials worked to determine if the building is safe. Channel 3 Hartford Bureau Chief Aya Galal is live on the CCSU campus with an update on where things stand now. Aya. Hi, Aaron and Mark. Well, fire officials determined that it is safe for students to be inside of the building, so students have been able to go back inside of the residence hall, and contractors have been inside the building all day making repairs. Fortunately, nobody was injured in this fire. This photo shows the moments an electrical fire started inside of the James Residence Hall on the CCSU campus. Just hearing the alarms and seeing, like, five fire trucks here, I was like, I was really nervous like yeah. my heart was beating really fast mm -hmm. I didn't know what was going on. Ava Kaluski is a freshman and lives on the third floor of the building. She's relieved her belongings were not damaged in the fire. All of it's okay it's just like kind of smelling bad that's that's all. The fire started around six o'clock Monday evening. Students saw the flames and pulled the fire alarm. 350 students got out safely. I was actually sleeping and then the alarm was going off and I woke up confused so I just got dressed and went down the stairs and came outside. The sprinkler system went off on the first floor and the fire was contained to the lobby area. 57 students stayed in a hotel last night as fire crews worked to determine if the building is safe. The ceiling did have to get replaced because that was charred debris. Mm -hmm. Students had smoke in their rooms on that first floor, but we were able to air it out last night and get a contractor in there to help mm -hmm. kind of clean and make the air healthy. Mm -hmm. um, but it is safe. Students tell Eyewitness News they are relieved there was not damage to the dorm rooms and they've been let back into the building. Yeah, I'm happy because I was stressing about if I was going to be able to get my stuff because my laptop was in there, all my products and stuff. The university tells us students can fill out a loss form if they feel something did get damaged in their room. I hope they could get the smoke smell out, though. Yeah. But we have, like, all the windows open. And the state fire marshal's office continues to investigate the fire. Contractors will continue making repairs inside of the building these next few days. A lot of students will go home on Friday for spring break. Live in Newburgh in Agnan, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.